Blacksmith Brewing Company not only has the distinction of being Montana's newest brewery, it has the distinction of being the newest brewery in the oldest community. The Bitterroot Valley community of Stevensville was founded in the 1840s, and somewhere along the line, somebody built a nice brick building that served as a showroom for buggies, and finally a blacksmith shop. I just saw a need for it here in Stevensville. A good, clean place, good people, good conversation. Uh, the community thing, people are sticking closer to home, you know, knowing where their beer comes from and where their food comes from and, and that sort of thing. And so I just, I saw this old dumpy building and, <laughs> and everybody thought I was crazy because <laughs> it was a pit. Amidst the rubble of renovation, co-owners Pamela Kay and Eric Hayes found historical items like an old map and pallets bearing the brands of long-ago ranchers. Um, you know what? We tried to reuse everything in here. This was old floor joists or ceiling rafters. The bar was the old floor joists out of the office, all those old fans. We just kind of reused them as much as we could in the whole building. But... You might be surrounded by history at Blacksmith Brewing Company, but the place is contemporary enough to provide a great taproom experience all the way around. Oh, and lest I forget about the beer, brewer Mike Howard, formerly of Stone Brewing Company, and lately of Big Sky Brewing Company, keeps the locals happy with a range of beers from a friendly blonde to a ridiculously rich porter. The Ten Barrel Century Brew House. Direct fire. Um, pretty manual. Well, I wanted to design a light beer for the Bud Light drinkers, you know, transition beer into the darkers. So I did American Style Hefeweizen is our number one seller. We sell a lot four to one. And then I'm a hop head, so I wanted to get a strong hoppy pale, a nice dry hopped IPA, and then a nice robust dark border. You won't find stacks of kegs piled up or bottles of beer coming off a bottling line here. Blacksmith Brewing Company is as local as it gets, and the locals seem to like it that way. For grizzlygrowler.com, this is Tim Ackerman.